One man, one vote, one shilling. One man, one vote, one shilling. One man, one vote, one shilling. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So we are ready. Yes. support one man one shilling one vote a formula today is a historic day in this country we have won for the first time since we started this battle this formula was brought before the senate two years ago before it became a chief whip before we had a change of leadership but the previous leaders refused deliberately to bring this motion i decided as a chief whip to bring this motion and today we have won after a protracted battle. And I want to thank all the senators who have agreed to support uh, this formula, this motion. For the first time, we are seeing more money now going forward. We'll be going to the counties that were densely populated. Uh, counties like Nairobi, Nandi County, Kiambu, Nakuru. To me, that is progress, like Kipia, Moranga. But that does not mean that we are going to oppress the so-called traditionally marginalized counties, they have also gained. But at least justice to the one man, one shilling, one vote has been rendered today. Uh, the journey has been very long and tedious. Remember previous proposals that were on the table. At one moment, they had proposed what we call a baseline of 316 billion. Now, the, then they, we pushed them they proposed a baseline of about 273 billion. Today, that baseline has been slashed all the way to 158 billion, and any monies above 158 billion is going to be subjected to the third generation formula. And that to us is a win. Remember, at one moment, the so called Sakaja Linturi Amendment, Muranga County was set to lose 15 million Kenya shillings. But today, I'm happy to report to the people of Moranga that Moranga is going to gain 800 million Kenya shillings. I take this opportunity to thank His Excellency Uru Kenyatta uh, for his intervention yesterday. Yesterday, I was part of the delegation that went to see His Excellency Uru Kenyatta. And we pleaded with him. He, he devolves more funds. He agreed with that request. He added 53 billion, and on the basis of that 53 billion, uh, counties have been able to get their monies today. We have been able to unlock the stalemate that has been bedeviling counties for a very long time. And I want to report to the country that the stalemate is now over. We have passed the formula. We are currently passing the so-called CARA. We are going to stay, to stay here in the Senate until we ensure CARA passes. And from tomorrow, counties can now receive their rightful share. But for me, I'm so happy that uh, the so-called Linturi formula that had proposed Moranga to lose 15 million is gone. Other formulas that were oppressive to Moranga or even the so-called uh, big counties are gone. But it is only justice to the Kenyan. It's not justice to the people of Murang only, or the people of Nandi or Laikiki. All Kenyans have benefited. We have now one united Kenya. We have one country. And we are it not for the intervention of His Excellency Uru Kenyatta, this stalemate could still be going on. For the first time in the Kenyan history, Senate has been able to push the executive and add more money to the counties. Kenyans are going to benefit in terms of more roads by the counties are going to be made, more hospitals are going to be built by the counties, more pre-primary schools are going to be built by, by the counties after you are able to lobby and have central government, national government, agree to send more money to the counties. Okay. Asante uh, sana. Siku ya leo tunataka kumshukuru Rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya Mheshimiwa Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta kwa vile ambaye yeye ndiye ameleta mauiano katika juma hili letu baada ya kuongeza bilioni uh, na tatu, nukta tano. Na sisi tunasema ya kwamba jambo lililoteneka nzuri kabisa ni ya kwamba 
vile mwito ule tuliokuwa nao mwito wa kura moja mtu mmoja imeweza kushinda na sisi tunasema kwamba tumeshukuru lekipe ya county ambayo kwa formula zile zote ambazo zilikuwa zikiletwa lekipe ya county ilikuwa ikipata takriban takriban uh, uh, takriban milioni mia sita. lakini sasa tunapongea na nyinyi hivi lekipe ya county imeongezewa hela na inapata zaidi ya milioni mia saba, uh, hamsini na nane. kwa hivyo hilo ni jambo la muhimu sana lakini lile ambalo ningependa kusema ni ya kwamba baada ya sisi kufanya kazi hii kwa kujitolea mhanga kufa tuambie magavana wetu wasitumie hizi hela kiholela holela kwa kujinufaisha wa wenyewe wazitumie kutengeneza barabara zetu kwa sababu barabara ni mbaya wazitumie kwa kuleta madawa katika hospitali yetu kujenga mabawa ndio wananchi wetu uweze kunufaika na mambo ya maji itakuwa ni jambo la kuvunja moyo sana ikiwa sisi kama seneti tumejikakamua na tukaweza kuongeza hela ambazo zinakwenda katika kaunti zetu alafu tupate zile hela zikitumika kiholela watu kujinufaisha zikitumiwa kwa mambo ya kuwagandamiza wananchi wale ambao wanapaswa kuwa akitumiwa zile hela kwa hivyo sisi kama senate tunataka kupongeza na tunapongeza tuna wenzangu maseneta kwa sababu tumeungana tukawa kitu kimoja na tukapitisha huu mswada ili hali ya pesa ziweze kuongezeka na niombe watu wetu wa pale Muranga wanandi wanakuru kwa sababu pesa zimeongezeka na mwito wetu tuliokuwa tunasimama nao na tuliendelea kusimama nao kwa sababu huduma zinapelekwa kwa wananchi huduma ipelekwe kulingana na ukubwa wa kichaka ama msitu kwa hivyo hii mwito wetu wa mtu mmoja shilingi moja one man one vote one shilling imeweza kupoa kipao mbele na ikaweza kupita sante sana thank you and, and finally i am happy Uh, I don't know whether we call this 11th wonder of the world that uh, the senator has finally resolved this issue. One I'm happy because Nandi has consistently gained. Uh, now Nandi is going home with 1.64 billion additional equitable sharing revenue and I believe Nandi County now will be able to move forward in terms of development agenda, bursaries, roads and many other things. Secondly, I'm happy that uh, the shutting down of counties now is over and the stalemate is over. So we expect counties to be up and running and ensure that uh, we move forward and ensure devolution works. Thirdly, I want to thank everybody including Senate and the executive for ensuring that they gave us additional 53 billion. Now we have a baseline of 370 billion and therefore counties, no county Uh, we will we'll lose we are now gaining and i think oh, everybody is gaining and that was the principle of one man one vote one shilling the principle of one man one vote one shilling was to ensure we include this every county into a country called one nation one people and one kenya and also recognizing our diversity and that is why we promoted the issue of equity equality and now every county is in a position to celebrate for all this so i'm happy the the devolution will will be a success story not only in Nandi County, in Muranga, in Nakuru. And fourth and final is that uh, we have rectified an injustice to populous counties, where populous counties were being marginalized by being perceived that they are rich and able. So on this aspect, I'm happy this is a win for all of us. This is a win uh, for us who believe in the principle of equity and equality, on the principle of one man, one vote, one shilling. And going forward, we, we are yet to see more. And we want to thank Kenyans for the patience. It was not easy c coming to this, being my, my friend here, We have been members of the famous 12 disciples that have broken the truth and we are happy that uh, our colleagues have agreed with us with the formula that is before the house the various parameters that we have uh, we have having so twende uh, mbele pamoja Kenya ni yetu sisi wote tunataka tuambie magavana mambo ya ku shut down county sasa si possible twende sasa kufanyia kazi raia na magavana sasa waanze kufanya kazi lakini tunadhaa tuwaombe wakati tunapowaita katika bunge la senate kuja kujibu maswala ya kuajibika kwa pesa lazima wakuje waje sasa kujificha wafanyie wananchi kazi na waache ubabe wa kisiasa ambao walikuwa wameanza kuanza kwa wakati huu so we are very happy we are very proud in this 11th wonder that senate has been able to crack this uh, reversal and our resolve is more united to ensure the principle of one man one vote one shilling goes to the full fruition yeah thank you One brief I want to also join my colleagues in really saying that this is a big day for this country. I want to say that the decision that was taken by the Senate today is a decision that speaks to a united Kenya. 
a decision that says we have a leadership in this Senate that does not believe in the old ways of doing things. That you have to define people according to where they come from and how their lives have been. We have corrected a historical mistake today. Correct. And I want to thank the people of this country for standing with us. And what to say, because this is important to be said. Now the battle goes to the, to the governors. We have struggled to get this money. The money is not going to governors. We must put it on record that we will ensure that every cent that is given to these governors is spent in the right way to improve the lives of our people and especially the youth. We must, we must see youth programs running in our counties, a situation that has been lacking in almost every county in this country. Lastly, I want to thank the seven senators. The seven senators led by Senator Kipchumba Murkomen, Senator Malala, Senator Kabaka, Senator, and the other Sakaja. senators, Sakaja, who Linturi, Lagat, and Cheruyot. Yeah. Senators who initially were gaining money, but they said no. Because there are some sen sen counties that are losing and we are gaining, we will stand with the losing counties to make sure that everybody gains something. Because of that effort, today, even those counties that were gaining a little money are going home with a lot more money because of the sacrifice of those seven senators. To them, I say thank you and let us forge forward to make sure that we liberate this country from the shackles of neocolonialism. Thank you. Thank you. Sana. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Asante sana. I love to hear um, first of all, we, we are very, very happy today that finally, uh, as a Senate, we found a solution to a problem that has been with us for now nearly four months, uh, voting without uh, solution. After the twelfth time, we have uh, managed to make a decision. We are also very, very proud of uh, the team of Senators called Team Kenya because we stood firm against marginalization and against uh, uh, disenfranchisement of the part of the country. And uh, tonight we have the best news. I am extremely elated and happy that we passed a formula that clearly says in the resolution that there is no county that will get any money less than what they were getting uh, in the last financial year. Meaning, going forward, every county gets resources over and above what they have been getting. You all remember that there was a formula called Kibiru formula and committee formula that was uh, taking away two billion in Wajia, Gariza, and all those counties. About 18 counties were losing, and uh, it was taking away the 316 billion away from these counties. Today we have made a resolution that is completely opposite of that formula and the formula that we have now says all counties will get what they are getting on the 316 and above. Number two, uh, I want to hasten to say that in this resolution we have also inbuilt the promise of the national government that they will add another 53.5 billion to counties so that the counties next year will be allocated uh, 370 billion. You all remember that under what was called Kangata uh, Amendment, counties were to wait for two years before benefiting from uh, the bad formula that had been proposed by the committee. The 50 billion that has been inbuilt, 53.5 billion promised by national government, shall come into effect next year, and all the counties benefit. You all know, if you've looked at the formula, Elgeo Marakwet, which was to get 300 million, is now getting 750 million. Uh, uh, Kakamega, which was to get uh, in the other formula 900 million, is now getting 1.7 billion, which is 1.9 billion, which is actually near 2 billion. Uh, and, and so you can see uh, Garissa, Mandera are still getting 800, 900 million, meaning that uh, unlike the agenda that was being advanced by people who don't who hate the unity of this country. Uh, this formula that we have fought for so hard that unfortunately some of our colleagues like Senator Langard, Senator Malala and Senator Lelegwe were arrested. Their arrest 
their pain, their suffering, did not go in, in, in did not go in, it was not in vain. We are very happy that eventually we have made a good resolution. As young politicians, we, this was a fantastic learning lesson. We have now learned that if you, if you stand firm in your principles, you are able to also uh, uh, get victory. I have seen some of my colleagues here celebrating, saying, oh, you know, uh, uh, our side won, the government gave more money, and so forth. They gave, the government didn't give more money. They were forced to give more money because we fought so hard that it was impossible for anything to happen in these chambers. And it took the sacrifice also of an extra seven senators. Senator Malala, Sakaja, myself, Senator Kabaka, Senator Cheruyot, Senator Langat, you know, Linturi. and Senator Linturi, to make personal sacrifice that even though our counties were being lured to accept that bad formula with little amount of money, our hard uh, sacrifice, our hard work, and as even double what we were expected to be given in a bad formula. Meaning that in life, if you do the right thing, you are likely to benefit more than if you are going to do the wrong thing for your personal benefit. So this is really a win tonight. We are extremely happy. We want to congratulate our colleagues for, for what they've done. Uh, we want to tell those people who are planning divisive agenda to bring to this house that watch this space. You've seen what we've done. We are not going to allow a divided uh, uh, Senate. We are not going to allow a divided country. We are going to do everything possible to give our country together. Thank you. Uh, thank you. My name is Senator Clefas Malala. The last time I appeared uh, before media, I was shedding tears. <laughs> but today, I'm a delighted man. And uh, I'm a very happy leader today because we have achieved what we've been fighting for. We have been fighting for a win-win formula. And let it be known that today the Senate has passed a win-win formula. We had said that we shall not accept other counties to benefit while others are losing. This is what we've cured today. And as Senate, we want to say that we are proud of our leaders today, and more specifically, the leaders of Team Kenya, the leaders who stood together to ensure that we do not pass uh, a resolution that is going to be punitive, that is going to divide this country. And as young leaders, this is the message that we want to give to this Republic of Kenya, that we shall not, over, we, we shall not accept to have a country which is divided on the, on, the, on the lines of marginalized communities and those communities which are rich. We are going to ensure as young leaders, we are going to put this country together and move uh, to prosperity together. Lastly, we have had a very uh, divided house uh, uh, for the last uh, 10 weeks. Personally, I've had a very rugged uh, political journey, but I am happy that all our efforts have not gone to, uh, to, to the trenches. I want to thank, more specifically, the leaders of Team Kenya and all those senators who burned the midnight oil to ensure that we come with a win-win formula. And to thank the entire leadership of the Senate for also accepting and ceding ground because uh, were it not for them to sit ground, we wouldn't have found a win-win formula today. And therefore, lastly, to assure the people of Kakamega that in the previous formula that they were trying to dangle a carrot on us, we were gaining a mere 900 million shillings. But today, out of our struggle, we've managed to, uh, have managed to take to Kakamega 1.976 billion shillings. And therefore, it's a win for Kakamega, it's a win for Vihiga, it's a win for Turukana, and it's a win for Kenya. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.